When some said, you know what, we should just let Detroit go bankrupt. We made a bet on American workers and American innovators and American companies. And today the auto industry is back on top of the world. A crisis this deep didn't happen overnight. And it's not going to be solved overnight. So we've got more work to do. We know that. And that's why this year is so important. Because we know the last thing we can afford to do is to go back to the very same policies that got us into this mess in the first place. And my opponent in this election, Governor Romney, he, he, he's a patriotic American. He's raised a wonderful family. He should be proud of the great personal success he's had. Uh, no, I, I mean, you know, he has been extraordinarily successful at, at the financial firm uh, that uh, he helped put together. But, but, but I, I think he's drawn the wrong lessons from these experiences. He seems to believe that if CEOs and, and wealthy investors uh, like him are getting rich, that the rest of us automatically do too. The challenge right now, the challenge we've faced for over a decade is that harder work for too many people doesn't lead to higher incomes. And bigger profits don't necessarily lead to better jobs.